Hi, hope you are doing well. This is task 21D of web authoring, chapter 21. In this task, we are learning to create a table using HTML tags. But here, we are learning new three tags. What are those tags as per the sections of the table? Here, if you see, there are three sections of the table. One is called the header and the body. The last one is footer. So, based on these three sections, we have three tags. Here you see T head, T body, and T food. If I show you here, this is a T head, T body, and T food. They are container tags where they got a pair of tags, the starting and the ending. All these three. I need the same order. That's important here. The header row, what you see here, the header row, we call it the field headings on the first topmost row of the table. It is header row. So that contains the headings of the table. Right? So that is with T head we can script it next comes the body here from here if you see apple till the lemon see the division of the lines fruit and price as in the header row and apple to lemon in the body these are simple rows and with values right but here when you come down there is a total and it is totaled as well the total price of all the uh, fruits food is always at the end of the table even in the page in in any uh, document also it's it is end of the page is called footer so t food in the sense tables food that's the last row of the table it contains the final uh, result of any calculations or any summary of the table. T food. When we script it, right? When we uh, write a markup, we have to follow the same order. Now, let's see more. T hat got TR since it's a header row and each word this one is specified with th tag th end of th now start again th end of th of price every scene in this row first row you have two values you have two values so two th will come now, as you know, in the previous task, we did the caption with caption tag. That's the uh, heading or the title of the table. Caption, end of caption. Right? Okay. Now, when we see the body, that's T body, table's body from apple to lemon. These are simple rows. We use every row with the TR and every value with the td tables data here every value with th in the header row now come down t food is the last row of the table and in this as well every value is taken with td only we are not changing anything in this t bodies value and t foods value we specify with only td but only with th we use in the only t head in the header row hope this is clear 
Now let's go back to the book. Here they told us to uh, add one caption for sales that we're going to add. Uh, we already learned to give a caption in the previous task. You see here, this is one. And the good part is the whole code of creation of this table is given here. Look at that. From the beginning till the end. Now, hope you uh, already have it in your mind to discuss about this one. Just recall border, tables border, the single one. Width is one. This is called width. Border is equal to one. If you take two, it will get thicker. If you take three, it will get thicker. Now, caption, you know well how to give a caption of the table. Now, here you see this part is the one we have to talk about. Yeah. So, if you this is T head. Right. See this. This is T head. Now, let's go for here. Actually, this T foot has to be at the bottom. Be careful. This T foot has to be at the bottom after t body follow as it is in the uh, sections of the table first t head t body and t food so here ask second one to be t body from here we will put this as a second one in our program t body it's the second one now the third one is t food this is the third one t food this is the first row for us we're gonna arrange this code this is the third one and this is the second one in this order we'll arrange that code now and the you know well end of table end of body then end of html now you see table's body got the first row of apple second row of orange you can just match it over here our third one is pear banana and lemon yes these are five rows and t food got total and its uh, amount of total here is the one okay now what we're gonna do is let's copy this whole thing let's copy this whole thing sorry here okay then we're going to paste it in expression web where is it going? we're going to paste this in expression web okay open expression web this is untitled one here here open the code here code just you can paste the new one this one i brought from there okay now if you see in the design let me just check what is the result Look at that. Total is coming as a second one. Can you see this one? Total. What I said, first of all, the header row, second, the body, then third is the food. Now we will arrange it just like that. Bring this T food down. Uh, where is the T food? T food. Here is the T food. Look at this. End of T food. Just cut this from here. And just go down uh, after T body. Paste it there. Okay, now let me just see the design of it. Uh, even just, I will, let me just save it first. Uh, what I'm going to save it with. 
I receive it in my yeah here I can save it in my folder uh, chapter 21 just I'll create one folder by altering Here I have zero, but three <coughs> one D task. I have to write task three one. Sorry, D. A dot order. Save. So you can see the file name, the page name it is. Now let me check. Just save it. Whatever you make changes once, just click on save to apply the changes in the result. Design. Can you see here? The total came down. Yeah. This is what you are supposed to get. Okay. 